So here's a tip for you guys. If you ever come and try to fish this cable pool, um, these ropes and, and these rocks are very slippery. How do you feel about that, huh? guys this morning we're at the cable pool on the Capilano River and we're gonna try to catch a big fish using big dry flies like grasshoppers it's my first time uh, trying to get into those those rocks so uh, let's see if we can find the way and see if there's room for us I just come down here. I've never been here before, so. <sighs> See what I'm working with here, guys? How do you feel about that, huh? Is this the only, this is the only way down, yeah? Yeah. That's a little bit sketchy. Be careful, man. Can I trust this rope? Yeah. All right. <laughs> I wish I could do something with my rod. Yeah. All right. This is intense. stressful guys plan today try to catch a single fish on a big dry fly hopefully it's a fish that's bigger than six inches <laughs> Had a little. Pardon me? Uh, no, I just have floating. But I, I'm going for trout, so I just had a bite. So I'm. If I get a trout, I'll be happy. Oh, that's a huge trout right there. Some big fish in here, guys. I can see the big fish just cruising. Really? Right in front of me? Come on, fish. You guys see that fish out there? The coho like to jump kind of where the, the canyon narrows here as well as in the pool above. Oh, I see a fish. Fish just looked at it and swam away. If I keep seeing fish uh, swim away from this, guys, I'm gonna throw something smaller. Big splash, guys, come on. Oh, fish just tried to take it, but it was about half the size of the fish. Now, the problem with dry flies in this water, guys, is um, these fish live here, they know how slow this water is and they know that they can take all the time in the world to try to attack that fly, <laughs> get a good look at it, decide what they want to do. I see a big fish right in front of me, guys. I can see his white rotting tail. Yeah, the coho are just chilling. Oh, someone made it here. Okay. I did not think you could get there. You must have done some serious rock climbing. 
So here's a tip for you guys. If you ever come and try to fish this cable pool, um, these ropes and, and these rocks are very slippery. And um, what I've seen so far is people keep their rod in a rod case on their shoulder and they use two hands to climb up. I'm in a shitty position where I didn't bring my rod holder with me and I didn't know that. So if you come, don't prepare your rod at home like I did, but actually bring your rod holder and just prepare it on the rocks. It'll be way safer. All right guys, a few more casts and I think we're actually gonna change it up. I wanna go downstream just of these pools because there's some fast water and I know I can pick up a fish in fast water. I feel pretty confident I can pick up a fish in fast water, guys. All right, let's do, let's do the sketchy thing where we climb up this darn rope. I gotta climb up this thing, guys. I gotta get up there. It's f***ing sketchy. That's not the worst thing I've ever seen. All right, let's not rely on the rope. Use it as a guide. This right here is the sketchy part, guys. I'm gonna do a couple things. I'll put my GoPro here. Put my rod here, guys. Oh man. I do not like heights. Good view though. God, that's sketchy. I don't know if I'm doing this again, guys. Man, my heart is beating really fast right now. I just, I don't do well with heights and like, I didn't come out here to fall into like a 21 foot pool, but hey, look at this. That's what I want. I'm gonna go, there's a little path here and I'm gonna go and hit those pools and we're gonna get a fish 100% guys. Let's go get one. You guys catch anything yet? Oh, good luck. So I'm hoping I'll catch a fish on a dry fly. If I do, I can show them. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, cool. I'll, I'll try my hardest. There's a family here and I told them it's a little bit easier to catch fish on a fly in fast water. And then if I catch one, I gotta show the kids. So let's go catch those little kids a fish.
Ja, bei 